elevation is all around me, particularly with the stunning rolling mountains behind me on the edge of Lake Como. Rizzo, rise, they say over here. But I thought it would be very interesting to capture elevation with these steps on the edge of this jetty. So I've launched Close Shape on the Mosier app. By default, we've got a straight line. I've captured my start point. I'm just going to move down here, capture that point. Now, Mosier, as I move along from, you know, from the top to down here, it captures all the minutiae. Let's just move across here. Point is captured. And there we go. As I move along, you can see that the lines, the drawing is drawn out on the screen with all the numbers. It's calculating as I move along the edge. I'm so glad, given that I'm living on the edge here, that I don't have to tax my brain, which is not very good at multitasking and been able to measure the numbers, write them down. Things probably would fall in here and try and draw out this measurement all at the same time. But Mosier does everything for me. I literally just have to place it down, put one foot after the other and ensure that I don't fall into this place. Easy. I think it's facile. Easy over here. Anyway, just going to fast forward. Now when I get down here, you can see that we got water. It's splashing over the device, but it's waterproof. It's water resistant, so there's no need to worry. It still captures the point, as you can see on the screen there. More water splashing over. Okay, fast forward up here. Okay, and here we are making our way to the end. Place it down there. Press the stop, start, finish button. Press that and straight away you can see we got our total perimeter. Uh, we have got, let's just place that there. Can I see if I don't fall over? So we've got our total perimeter. We've got our total area. Uh, we can see if I go into plan. Uh, that's the plan view if I go into 3D. You can see that we got the elevation, the rise and fall of every step along the way. All the little minutia, all the detail. If I want to get the cross section from, let's say, the bottom to the top, there you go, we can get the rise and the fall. The Z represents the rise, the Z, Z axis, resolve for, is for, for the rise over here. And on any point I can get the rise, so I'll just select different points along the way. You can see how the rise changes, the elevation changes. Let's do a deeper dive and just go into the cross-section into gradient, gradiente, I believe they say. And there we go. You can see we've got the gradient as well. Got all our numbers. So easy. So that's how easy it is to capture something as simple as elevation, even if you are living on the edge in such a beautiful location as where I am now in Villa Erba, or Erba Villa, Lake Como.